guys? Today I'm going to show you how to customize your Samsung lock screen and look like this to this. And this is going to be just a quick little tutorial on how to customize your lock screen. So let's get started. Before I get started, I just want to say um, that I'm sorry, like how the audio sounds. I didn't realize like it would be so like echoey. Um, so yeah, let's to get back to the video. What you're going to do is press and hold on the lock screen and you could either do face ID, um, you do face ID or pattern, um, fingerprint, whatever you have set for your security. Um, and then to customize your uh, clock, you're just going to press on it. You can adjust it to any size you want. I usually have it as big as you can. Um, and I usually have like this chalk one, which I think is really cool. We have different like forms you can put it as. You could have an analog clock or like, is that analog? I don't know. We could have like an actual clock. But I usually have it as this, and then you can also customize these um, buttons down here, which you cannot do on iPhone. Um, we were hoping to, and you can leave contact information, so, or your name of your YouTube channel. Um, and then to customize wallpapers, you're just going to press on wallpapers, and I'm going to go ahead and find the one that I wanted. It should be just, oh wait, not gallery. Um. Here it is. Okay, so just press on whatever wallpaper you want to use and hit done. And you can also, it will be the color, okay. Let's see if we can do this. The color of your uh, clock will be the like a matching color or you could pick whichever color you want that's on the bottom. You can even create your own color by just pressing that. And then you have the spectrum or you can also edit. So let's see. Uh, tell us what that color number is. Uh, I usually have it out white for this wallpaper, which I think actually looks really good. And I'll leave a link um, where you can download this wallpaper down in the description. And yeah, that's just a super quick... Oh, actually, you have filters you can do too. To, let's see, frosty. Um, basically, black and white. Soft. Again, frosty. Cool. I'm assuming you get warm or original. I don't know, frosty looks kind of cool. So yeah, that is how you customize your wallpaper. Uh, uh, <laughs> okay, this that's how you customize your lock screen on a Galaxy S23 Ultra. If you enjoyed that video, please consider subscribing for more tutorials, and I'll catch you in my next one. See you then.